How's it going everybody? So today it's Friday and it's the day after Thanksgiving. One of the biggest shopping days of the year. So you're probably out doing that. Oh well. Today we're gonna make shotgun shell Christmas lights because Christmas is just right around the corner. So we have some Christmas lights that I just bought. These are LED Christmas lights which may or may not help us. We'll see. And then I have three festive looking shotgun shells. At least three colors. I have a bunch. Yeah, trust me. Mountains of shotgun shells. Mountains. So we've got our Christmas lights, we've got our shotgun shells, let's get started. Okay, so first of all we're going to plug in our hot glue gun. If you don't have a hot glue gun, you should probably get one, because they're cheap and affordable and useful. Just, just go get one, they're cheap. Okay, hot glue gun is hot. So let's uh, get this so I can figure it out here. So, all right. Uh, yeah, untangling Christmas lights. Tis the season. Uh, all right, there we go. Put this over there. All right. So, what color should we start out with first? Let's do red. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're gonna crimp these first. So go over here, start the crimp, and then we're not you'll wanna like go all the way in. Oh fuck. It's fine. It's still good. It's still good. We're just gonna do it. We're gonna do it. It's gonna be fine. No it's not. Fuck this one. Grab ourselves another one. Here we go. Okay, so we're going to start the crimp and then we're going to. Damn it. Do it one more time. Come on. Close enough. See? Well, yeah. Alright, so what we're gonna do the um the primer hole right here is about the same size as the uh the light. So there's a little bit of space in there. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna hot glue it in. There we go. Can I get it in there? Give it a little bit more hot glue around the edges to seal it up. And uh, I think that's about it. So we'll do next color. Let's do. Mm, mm, mm. Let's do this one. Let's do the uh, Yoki guys. Actually, let's. Uh, Let's finish the crimp on these guys first before we go any further. Good thing I have a seemingly infinite amount of these shotgun shells. Gotta get 
get used to the, the feel when it goes down. So I'll do the rest of these off camera. All right, so I've got them all crimped, um, kind of a loose crimp. Uh, yeah, so let's just do the green, this one next. Basically just putting the, the light bulb in there, and I'm sure this would work with normal non-LED Christmas lights that you buy, like, you know, Walgreens or Bartels or whatever your local equivalent of a, you know, general store, drug stores. They're drug stores, this is what they are. Um, let's just keep going. It's probably going to get a little tricky the more shotgun shells I have on here. Having flashbacks to when I made uh, snap caps. Oh man, this is going to take a while. Well, for me, not for you guys. You guys get to skip ahead in the future with little fast motion things and... So basically what I'm doing to get these on here is I'm just doing a big glob in the primer pocket and then Just uh, so here, doing a big glob in the primer pocket right here. And then I'll bring the light bulb up and just put it in there and spin it around so it kind of gets all over the actual light bulb itself. And then it kind of starts to dry almost immediately or harden because it doesn't dry, it just hardens. And then Go to the next one. So it's pretty simple, pretty easy. You could do this at home yourself, really easy. And you know, provided that you have however many shotgun shells for however many lights you buy. I'm just doing a, a roll of 50 lights here so this is two boxes of shotgun shells and if you go out and shoot shotguns at all that's you know not very much it's pretty cheap you don't have to do multiple colors either you could do you know all red red shotgun shells are really easy these are like just the cheap universal shotgun shells so May have messed up somewhere. We'll see. No, I didn't. I was about to, but I didn't. <laughs> I knew that was going to happen. I was like, what if I mess up the uh, the colors by accident? But I haven't done it yet. I was about to. Just to, almost there. Although I do need one more shotgun shell. Just one more. All right, so we'll uh, give these guys a little moment to cool down and then uh, we'll plug them in. This should be awesome. So they're all finished up. Here are the Christmas lights all plugged in. I'm a little bit worried that these, I think these are bare, like 
They're barely lighting up. It happens. Um, you know, some of them are lighting up better than others. So I'm going to put these up on the wall behind me and we're going to uh, turn off all the lights and show you how they look in the dark. And hopefully they look good. I hope. So, as you can see, they're all hung up and ready to go. Um, the green ones aren't lighting up very well. So, if you're going to do this yourself, I'd probably choose... Make sure that the light of the Christmas light will actually shine through the shell. I just kind of chose shells by the, uh, the color of them. So, I'm going to turn off the light and uh, we'll just kind of enjoy it. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. Um, hope you guys have a great holiday season. And uh, stay safe, and we'll see you next time.